we had a request. We've had a request now from our account managers for a single pane of glass, so to speak, for SaaS applications uh, for all our clients. Um, so that is what we have started doing here. Um, with, I'll just show you the page. Uh, this is so. This is the what uh, what they will see. This is the actual page. Um, it lists all the licenses they have, all of the data backup, SaaS protection, and before all of that. Uh, but the uh, the cool thing that I like about it is you can click the button to drill down further into um, the details which is what they specifically requested because um, they get asked a lot of questions during like QBRs and meetings about, well, who has what license? This will show you. Um, and with the filtering and searching in each table uh, provides a pretty easy and quick lookup um, for the different applications. I don't have all of them in here yet, but a good many of them that are frequently questioned about. Uh, the back end, I'm literally just storing everything in the Cosmos, uh, in a Cosmos database, and I'm running a the main workflow here weekly uh, because it takes a while to run. It's a lot of different actions um, for all of our clients. Uh, then I'm just querying that database every time and it's super fast. I mean, you saw how long it took to load the information when I opened up the page. Um, yeah, that's, I, this is the alpha alpha of what this eventually will look like. So just to Thanks. throw something out here to piggyback off of what Joe has said a little bit. When he started this project, there were four key objectives that we were trying to meet after discussing these issues with our account management team. And the first piece is absolutely that single pane of glass concept where they could get everything from one place. But the the other three goals that he was trying to accomplish with this was to make it easy for account managers to find solutions that uh, were available to be sold to those clients as well as give us the ability to do quick, simple billing audits for all of those SaaS products from one place. But the overall real impact here is a lot of the SaaS products that are out there don't really have adequate security roles or permissions for those groups to let the account managers get only the information they need. So the big thing that this is going to do in addition to simplifying that is it's going to save us a lot of administrative overhead and having to manage and maintain those accounts that have excessive permissions for tools that the account managers really don't need to have access to.